This is Kirk Sinclair, the Hiking Humanitarian, and I'm speaking with Jay Cohen, who is the director of the Winstead YMCA, and he's going to talk to us a little bit about the Northwest Connecticut Chamber of Commerce Leadership Team. So, Jay, what is the purpose uh, of that team? Uh, how, where does it come from? And uh, what have they done for the Winstead Y? Well, the Chamber of Commerce, you know, is a... Uh, a membership of businesses throughout the community um, but the great thing about it is it's, it's not only about how can businesses be helped and improved but how can the businesses give back their community and the, uh, my understanding of the leadership team in particular is giving people uh, a more in-depth experience of getting to know their community especially the organizations that really need help and support and each year they have a, a, a class of, of uh, of members who, who get involved and, and take on this experience and uh, it incorporates a, a number of things including you know educational pieces uh, you know where they learn about you know learn leadership skills and team building but then they also uh, take tours of uh, different organizations uh, nonprofit associations and things like that throughout the community and uh, in smaller groups they then select uh, what project they'd like to take on that year to help a specific organization. Uh, and this year, one of the, the groups uh, selected the homeless shelter here at the Winstead Y as uh, their beneficiary of their, their project. Um, and uh, they really did an incredible job. It, it was uh, kind of multifaceted, all with the, the goal of raising uh, funds and different resources for the shelter and for the, the clients who, who live in the shelter. Um, so they started off with uh, you know a, a direct fundraising campaign as well as uh, soliciting donations of bedding and, and uh, different accessories and uh, uh, things like soap and shampoo, all of which is you know is hugely needed. Um, but from there they uh, built up to a, a basketball tournament um, with all of the proceeds and sponsorship money all coming back to the Y. And for a first time event, uh, from people who have never coordinated a basketball term before, they really did a tremendous job. Um, they had uh, five or six teams there that day uh, who played all, all morning long, had a wonderful time. They all came with prizes and, and uh, more than anything that they had fun and knew they were doing it for a great cause. Um, and then wrap, they wrapped up their, their project season by uh, having two give back nights at the local McDonald's here in town uh, where they uh, partnered with the McDonald's to bring people in and then a portion of all the proceeds uh, from that evening were again coming back to the shelter. Um, so they just had their their final, uh, their graduation ceremony for the season for uh, finishing their project and uh, they anticipate donating well over a thousand dollars to the, the shelter from all of the work that they did. Well, that's excellent, Jay. Thank you for sharing that with us. Uh, this is Kirk Sinclair, the Hiking Humanitarian.